recording? There we go. How's it going, everybody? Well, uh, <clears throat> it's a rainy day in Portland. I stepped outside for a minute just to uh, drink my ginger ale, and I figured I'd make a quick video. Uh, <laughs> there is uh, a sad state of affairs with our parental leave in this country, and uh, it, it's horrible. I, I was actually watching John Oliver earlier, and he had a little segment on his latest show about it, and he said that the United States and Papua New Guinea are the only two nations in the entire world that don't have some form of paid maternity leave. And, uh, you know, when we had our kids, my wife took as much time as she could, but she had to go back to work. Uh, I stayed at home as much as I could. Fathers get absolutely no chance of parental leave. Uh, there was a story about a baseball player who recently, uh, they're allowed in professional baseball three days of leave when they have a kid. So he took his three days, and when he came back, everybody was all pissed off at him. And uh, there's all these, like, you know, uh, you know, sports channels and stuff saying, oh, you know, he... Baseball is the most important. He's got to get back there. It's, it's not like he's breastfeeding, you know. And, you know, folks without kids don't understand, but folks with kids don't understand a lot of the time, you know. It's like people raise their kids differently, but, you know, if you want to if you want to put work as a priority over your children, raising your kids, that's your personal choice. Uh, but for me, uh, family is most important. My children are most important. And we've never had a babysitter for my five-year-old. We did for my 21-year-old. Uh, well, he'll be 21 this year. Uh, we had a babysitter for him a lot of the time because we were both working and doing what we could. And we're at the point now where, you know, we can always have one of us here. And it's nice. I haven't had to ever really have... I've never had to have a babysitter for my five-year-old or two-year-old. And uh, some may say that they grow attached, you know, too attached, that they need time away. Sure, yada, yada. Uh, you know, people also say the same thing about you know, sleeping with your kids, which we did for a long time, and uh, it, it's a bonding experience, and once you bonded with your children, I mean, you'll do anything for them, you do anything for them anyway, but uh, that parental leave is so important, those first few months are the most important time, and it's sad, there's all these stories of mothers who had to decide when to take their time off, and most could only take about a month off, so for example, when one woman went into the hospital Wednesday, had her baby on Saturday, went back to work on Monday, you know, and decided to, because the baby was born premature, she decided to wait uh, to take her 30 days off until the baby was out of the hospital. You know, a mother should never have to leave her baby. And, you know, I was listening to these guys talk about it, these politicians saying, you know, uh, saying it's going to cost our businesses and, you know, businesses shouldn't have to foot the bill for this. This is society, you know, people. This is where our people come from. <laughs> babies are where our people come from <laughs> it seems like uh, some people just don't get it so hopefully you know you would think with the freest nation we would have the best health care and, and the best uh, ability for parents to take care of their kids but we don't we have the worst and uh, we're one of the you know one of the few countries that haven't got our health care issues together yet and then Americans are constantly yelling and complaining about more taxes and about uh, healthcare and how much it's costing us in taxes. Really, it's just, uh, it's just we're just spinning our wheels, you know, and our kids are going to laugh at us. The most important thing is health and family. So if you prevent damage to your culture by having people who are well-educated, well-taken care of, and loved by their family, they'll become more rounded people and we'll have rounded citizens. That's just basic chemistry. <laughs> Uh, anyway, have a great afternoon, evening, whatever it is, and uh, talk to y'all later.